Welcome back to consecutive day 927 of a diary of an entrepreneur. Please do give this a subscribe, share, like, comment as the more people we get in front of, the more money we raise on my fundraising mission to save the lives of children by attempting the ultimate ultra marathon. All the information about the challenge, how you can support it, is in the link in the comments below. Thank you as always for your support and let's get started. So, consecutive day, 927 of a diary of a rumpreneur. And uh, it's a tough one today. I, uh, I think I've come down with some kind of flu-like, COVID-like symptoms. Um, I'm pretty sure it's not COVID. Um, but um, regardless, I'm not feeling 100% by any stretch. In fact, I'm probably feeling about 50% uh, of my usual self. And... Um, Today I wanted to talk about overcoming adversity when you have to find the, find the, oh god it's so bumpy here, find the courage, the strength, um, the drive to actually get out here and do these runs when you're not feeling 100%. And I think how I deal with that is that, let's be honest, it's very rare we feel 100%. There's always something that we're not 100%, you know, maybe we've got a slight muscle related injury maybe you've had a few drinks the night before and you're feeling a bit under weather maybe you didn't get a good night's sleep it could be a whole multitude of reasons for why we very seldom do we feel 100 percent and i think the key is, is trying to get maximum output for whatever the state you're in and um i think a lot of it comes to mental resilience and uh an acceptance that you have to get it done um to put in perspective how rough I've been feeling today. I got up at usual time to kind of get the kids ready for school and everything about half past seven this morning and um, and then by the time the kids had gone to school uh, before nine I was back on on the sofa and I was, I was, I was almost falling asleep again but I did actually have a little sleep um, this morning so clearly my body needs rest to recuperate and to recover from uh, whatever I'm kind of struggling with at the moment but it's it's a strange one because I don't necessarily feel sick um, I just feel weak frail tired that's kind of the symptoms to, to how this this kind of bug feels there's a lot of bugs that go around this time of year it's notoriously uh, bad winter is for for picking up bugs here and there and uh, yeah I think ultimately how I how I overcome that is is that it's, it's not negotiable I'm out for this run every day right whether it's any weather condition i've run through covid i've run through um hangovers i've run through muscle related injuries i've run through sleep deprived nights you know it would take something monumental to stop me from doing this run and um i'm out doing it today my heart rate's higher than it would usually be i'm uh so i know i'm struggling with something i'm going slower than i usually would but i'm still out doing it and i think that's the, the important thing and, uh, and what it kind of pulls back into is is to understanding the power of your mind your body within reason will do what your mind tells it to do so as long as you've got a strong mental resilience and willpower to to get out there and do what you need to do your body will just tell the line within reason obviously there is a line that you can cross where that doesn't apply where your body's literally out of energy or out and, and just can't continue but to do a seven and a half kilometer run it would take it, that, that doesn't generally happen to get to those kind of depleted levels of energy so um so yeah that's pretty much all i want to say today i don't want to talk too much longer because um it's draining me doing so um i haven't been as productive at work as i would have liked on the back of this and secondly i've now got about five or six days in a row now where there's kind of festive social events that I need to try and attend if I'm fit. Um, so uh, that'll be kind of interesting to see how I uh, managed to pull through that. But I'll certainly be updating you on that over the coming uh, days of the week. So anyway, that's it for me. Any questions or comments, drop me a line. The moral of the story today is we rarely do we feel 100% and there's always a, a reason not to come out and do your run. Find that inner strength, find that mental resilience and condition your mind to push you through those periods of adversity 
and you'll be amazed at what your body can achieve. But anyway, uh, check the link in the comments below to find out more about the challenge, how you can support it. Do give us a subscribe, share, like, comment, uh, and as the more people we get in front of, the more money we raise. Thank you for your support as always. Stay positive, stay happy, and I'll see you again tomorrow.